The Apollo 11 the 50th anniversary, you've probably seen this particular iconic photo. Take a look at it there. It was taken in downtown Huntsville as people gathered to celebrate the Rocket City's role in a successful moon landing. Werner Von Braun is seen there hoisted on the shoulders of several men. <laughs> I met up with James Record Jr. at the Huntsville Madison County Library, one of the many buildings in and around Huntsville that his dad had a hand in funding and building during his many years of public service. From 1960 to 1980, all through the space program that was going on here in Huntsville and Madison County. James Record Sr. was a state senator, Madison County Commission chairman, and avid historian. He kept scrapbooks over the years and donated them to the library. This one happens to be about the moon. It's packed with clippings and photos from when Huntsville was helping put men on the moon. And when it finally happened, there was literally dancing in the streets of the Rocket City. It was very big for Huntsville, approximately 12,000 people. They converged on the courthouse square to celebrate with the man of the hour, Dr. Werner Von Braun. This is a picture of Von Braun's July 1969 calendar. Look closely at the entries for July 24th, Apollo 11 splashdown, followed immediately by the celebration downtown. When Von Braun arrived, he was picked up by several men and carried to the steps of the courthouse for a speech. So I don't think he did know that they were going to lift him and carry him up the courthouse stairs. A fitting hero's welcome, lifting the man whose rocket lifted men to the moon. This is my father right here in the center. Dr. Von Braun is on his shoulders, and then Pat Miller is here, and Chief Waters. Uh, both of these gentlemen were city councilmen. Record was a teenager at the time. He remembers the crowds and the bands and the flags and the fireworks shot from the roof of the courthouse. But he also remembers Von Braun's speech that day, where he was already looking forward to mankind's next achievement in space. He went ahead and was thinking that we've been to the moon now, let's look beyond the moon so our next step is Mars. The Mars, in fact, was always the ultimate mission for Von Braun, and Apollo 11, he noted, of course, was a significant first step. He told a local newspaper reporter here at the time of the moon landing, quote, I think the ability of man to walk and actually live on other worlds has virtually assured mankind of immortality.